So good morning everyone, this is team 5. So today we are here together in Otago Polytechnic, Auckland's international campus. So today we will be talking about Silwood Company, its problems and solution for them. Now let's start with the introduction. That is first is my friend Gurwinder, next is Amandeep, the girl standing, the leader girl is Manpreet, and the last one Uttamjeet. So first, I would like to do, introduce you about the company, which will be given by Gurwinda. So Gurwinda, please come in the front, introduce them about the company. Hello, everyone. Uh, today, I choose, uh, actually, our topic is on a silver sport company. So this company established on 1985 in Katy Katy, and it's, uh, this company divided into two, two parts. It's one part is in uh, Katy Katy, there they grow uh, some microgreens, lettuces, and after second part they deliver to uh, second part uh, which is in uh, Glenness. There they pack the old stuff and send to their customers in uh, big restaurants and even hotels. So this uh, this company st uh, started by uh, late Dave Silwood and Patricia Silwood. Afterwards, his uh, son Greg Silwood uh, joined this company. And this company achieved a, a award in 1999, the World Agriculture, and also uh, this company hold the record of a, a, a world uh, in in a small company. They grow a, a lots of lettuces and also microgreens. The company uh, hold a, this one record in a, also in a 1999. So, next part, I uh, my friend Manpreet Kaur introduce. Hello friends, my name is Manpit Kaur and now I am going to explain the problem background of the project. First of all, the Silver Export Company is very old and is a family based company in Auckland. Uh, however, the main problem of the company is the poor customer service which they deliver to their customer. Such as they do not deliver the ordered product on time. Uh, because of this, the customers are not satisfied with, the, with their services. Uh, moreover, there is a communication gap between the customers and the company and uh, there is a lack of training uh, for the employees uh, to deal with their customers and uh, moreover there is no proper sales and marketing team uh, in the company. Uh, the next is project plan, scope and aims. The purpose for doing this research is to recognize the problems occurring in the Silver Export Company and as I told that the major problem is the poor customer service and because of this they are facing loss in their business so that our search aim is to, uh, is to find, out the, uh, find out the reasons of this problem with the help of this they can achieve uh, their visions and missions and uh, to generate more opportunities for the future which is very good for them so the next part is we we'll discuss Sumit. Yep. So the next one is a research investigation method. So we use two methods. First was wise model in which we ask five questions to a manager or to a staff to know the problems and come come to its root from where the problem is coming. The next method was T M A I C, which stands for define, measure, analyze, improve, and control. And we also made a questionnaire which was for the manager and for the staff and for the customers. After getting that, what we asked in the first why model to the manager that what was the why, why the company is not providing customers a good service. So he said that the answer for that was delivery problem. So next question, when we move with the wise model, we ask the questions relating to the first question. So my next question was, why there is a problem in delivery so they said because there is a there's a lots of customers around so we have one is a, a communication problem with, between the customer and the management so that is the main problem of uh, delivery that is getting late and the next question i asked was why there is a gap between customer and the staff so the question was lack of training because some of the some of no, almost uh, the labor or the staff which is kept is just for packing. They don't know how to overcome or how to talk with the customer if he's there or he's on a the phone. 
so that was the main problem and the next was next question related to that was that why there is lack of training why they are not training so he said there is no policy regarding this in the company so my fifth question and the last was why there is no policy regarding the training because it's very important like you are facing a customer poor customer service so that is a problem and he said we are not find a budget for that so at the last we came to the root the problem was they don't have a proper budget for training of uh, new uh, new staff members which includes so uh, we had the other questionnaire for staff and uh, the customer as well which was shown in the assignment so not taking your more time i'll go to the next slide which is manage management concept and tools that was sports sports stands for strength weakness opportunities and threats checks so strength of the company is the, the customers the customers are loyal to the company weakness poor poor customer service like late deliveries opportunities they have newly newly the government they have came to the government and they starting forming the big plans which is really opportunity for them to overcome and last was the threats threats is like uh, we can say they are facing little bit financial problem so it's a bit threat for them and next one is next part will be explained by my friend uh, aman so aman i want you to explain the data please hello friend uh, today i'm going to talk about the uh, source of data we have two kinds of data the first one is the primary data and the second one is the uh, secondary data in primary data means uh, 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 collection of primary data is done by the interviews and uh, question areas and uh, <coughs> group uh, group investigations and uh, in primary in primary data uh, we have been uh, we have been uh, allowed to uh, organize and to put some interviews and questions uh, to the organization uh, organization managers and some uh, sales managers and uh, we will also uh, allowed to put some questions to customers and employees and some managers and in secondary data uh, in secondary data means uh, research done by other than the users and uh, in secondary data we got um, we got information from uh, online libraries and managerial uh, communications and uh, after that uh, after the analyze all data we got result uh, and we got three problems of uh, our company uh, the first one problem is the bad customer delivery and the second one is the uh, manager bad manage bad managers and the third one uh, and, and third one and the last one is the poor culture in the first problem uh, is the bad customer <coughs> delivery our company <coughs> silverwood company is a big company but they don't have enough employees uh, to deliver the product to customers so and the second one company is bad manager skills uh, manager of, of uh, silverwood companies don't have a, a ma uh, managerial skills so they don't they don't know how to the how to organize the staff and how to give the work to the staff and the third and last one uh, last one problem is the poor culture uh, this mean uh, company uh, don't have the uh, team breaks as like uh, they have an active competition with between the staffs and uh, the managers they don't have the break between uh, in the groups uh, there they can there they can discuss uh, on one topic rather than the work so these things uh, we found in the result after analyze the old data and the rest one uh, rest one information discussed by my friend sumit hello hello everyone i'm talking about the conclusion on silverwood company uh, the main uh, uh, problem in the company uh, they face uh, uh, loss in business because they fail to de de delivery on time in the company and after that uh, customers are not satisfied with the company because of late of delivery and uh, when when customer did not uh, they uh, did, did not buy their product on time so then they satisfied with the company and uh, and the main problem is internal and external problems uh, the uh, external problem is on, uh, delivery is not on time and the and the uh, internal problem is uh, like uh, uh com communication gap between the ma manager lower level manager uh, uh, ground level employers also and uh, that is, is uh, increase bad impact on customers because uh, because uh, 
no one can discuss uh, uh, good experience with the customers but the bad experience will, will everyone uh, di discuss with other uh, customers so it, it will increase bad impact and uh, after, after that uh, i'll talk about uh, recommendations uh, pr uh, provide proper training to em employees uh, when uh, employees uh, gain proper training then they uh, then they improve improve their communication and, and employee skills also and they give the uh, uh, proper pro, uh, and they and then they, then they give a proper uh, training to imp their employees and uh, and a company also apply tqm system tqm system is stand for training quality ma management in this system uh, m m uh, m manager and employees together work for company uh, for uh, for uh, growth of company also and uh, th there, there should be monthly meeting internal uh, after the meeting uh, they discuss with the problems uh, like uh, uh, what's, what's the problem with the lower level employees and uh, what's the problem uh, uh, regarding delivery so in the meeting they discuss all the all the problems and uh, company should also ad adopt a new technology when the company uh, should imp uh, ad adopt a technology then they in increase their customer rates also and uh, and they give training to customers uh, to how they how they uh, they work with the new technology and uh, and thank you so the, this was the presentation by team 5 for the problems and solution of Sidbull like export company so thank you so much thank you for your time and i will be ready to answer your time to answer your question any questions so um when you are talking about uh their customers so who, uh, or what's the uh percentage of different customer who's the major customer so team member Gurwinder will answer this because he's the working member in Silwood Expo. Uh, we, I, I'm working there, so I send uh, send uh, all products to a different customer uh, like uh, uh, restaurants, you know, Grand Millennium, Langham, and also uh, Sky. And I I go to a, a Grand Millennium Hotel, went to Grand Millennium Hotel, and I talk with the manager because I, I knew to him. So they they told me what's the uh, problems uh, going on. So how how I can improve. So they told me about this uh, reason and uh, uh, told me uh, problems. So uh, is there any uh, results from your survey? Uh, What you findings to your uh, actual uh, customer service? Actually, uh, we got our result, and I, I also t told to my company's manager and also my owners, and they will uh, discuss. Uh, they told me I, uh, we will discuss in the future, and we will also uh, we will also improve these uh, problems in future. So, okay. Thank you so much. Given the investigation you've done, um, what are your top priorities in terms of uh, recommendations for implementing? What, what are the most immediate ones which you think they can uh, readily adopt and start working on? The, start, the first, I would like to say, the first method which was is to provide them training. That will be the best method, and you just need to provide a new staff or the old staff just the training. When you give them a training, they will learn how to speak with the customers. So, if you know how to speak with the customers, I think half of the problems are solved. So, this is this is engaging with the customers uh, specifically in 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 what area? This is order order taking, accurate order taking is. Is that what you mean? Yeah, I'll explain you that also. Actually, the company mostly deals in the deliveries. So, all the deliveries, they get the phone calls, which you need to pick it up and you need to answer the calls very perfectly from which, from which area to which area you need to deliver the things. So, 
the long distance, first of all, it's just a communication on the phone. So for that, you, you, you need to be good hearer, and as well, you, to, you need to be, have good skills to speak with the customers. So I think that would be a better idea to provide them a training, so which will affect company with a profitable stuff. Yeah. yeah thank you, sir. Yeah. Uh, questions from the team here? Manfred, what's what's one of the key benefits that you've learned from participating in this project? Uh, first, I, le I learned the teamwork, uh, how to how to uh, collect the data, and uh, to uh, and how how to uh, work in a team better. Thank you. Thank you. Um, and Otamjee, what's what's been a key challenge that your team faced that you that you overcame? Uh, yeah. Uh, when when uh, we work in a team, uh, then we uh, we don't don't know how to work in a team, and uh, we when we discuss our meet uh, in meetings. Then uh, we discuss about the problems, how how we finish our project, and how how we collect the data from the company. So there's some. Right. Good. Well done. Thanks. Thanks, Dave. Thank one, one more you. thing, which I would like to tell you on the team five behalf. So limitations which we were having is first was the time limit, and the other thing was this company Silverwood is not on website. So it was really difficult for us because we have a limited time for the gathering the source and providing it in an assignment. So it was really difficult for us to go there and get the answer, questionnaire answered. So that was a really difficult job, but thanks to Gurvinda, he made it possible because they worked morning to, to, uh, to noon 12. So he, he just provided us the appointment, so really thankful to him. Actually, can each of you actually uh, tell the audience what's your role in the research project, please? Pardon? Uh, each, of you, would you, each of you tell the audience what, what is the role of yours in the research project. What were the roles? Actually, yes. actually ma'am, uh, I would like to tell you from my opinion, because as Sir decided he was the chairman and someone is assistant, someone is data gathering, so what we did was, first we decided to do it like that way, but that was really difficult for us. Then we came as a team, he provided us a appointment, we went there, interviewed the questions, the all things were done together and it was an acknowledgement of everyone and then we analyzed it, sitting together and we came up with the, the solution. Right, the judges will just uh, come Okay, uh, well done team. I really like your presentation and especially you have done your uh, research apparently uh, for the uh, background of the uh, entity. And also I really like actually how you showed or demonstrate your knowledge of the applied management you learn in this, in this class, which is very good. Well done team. Thank you so much. Team involvement was there and uh, Manpreet's presentation was very pleasant and uh, very nice to hear and the confidence of Sumit, I really appreciate that. Like they just said that uh, his, uh, Smith, his, his confidence levels was very mature and even she was also improved from last time. So this is what I just... <coughs> um, I think one, one area, uh, uh, t two of you uh, took, took charge of the presentation in the sense of coming front stage. Um, that Utamjeet and, and first of all uh, Gawinda and, and that gives a good sense of 
we're in charge, we know, we are confident. Uh, confident. So, so that, was, that was a good body move uh, to, uh, to do that. Let's just uh, quickly go through areas uh, for uh, in, improvement. Well, the presentation could have been more to the point. Sometimes I felt there were more words used to present a simple thing that could have been just said in the line. Okay. Succinct, that word. Okay. Um, they should give some more explanation to what their points. Right. Two completely different points of view there. Rodeo. Okay. That's what they say. Right. Okay. Nothing to add. Uh, right. Uh, first of all, uh, I think this again is a common problem. Uh, when you make recommendations, it should be relevant. It should be based on the evidence you have collected. So uh, I've noticed this several group and actually you, when you reach the re stage of recommendations you feel like oh the hard work has been done and I can just go free with that but no actually it's still part of your research and you should really make the recommendations according to what you have found so far okay so we don't make really out of air recommendations yeah and also uh, the flow of the presentation uh, actually uh, before Amman presented the methods you are going to use for this research and uh, Summit has already uh, started presenting part of his findings so I think regarding the uh, flow of the presentation it's better you know actually you introduce your research design first and then reach the stage of the results and it's actually how we do research as well. Yeah. Uh, apart from that, it's all good. Yeah. Well done, Tim. Okay. Um, you've got the slide there. Just two minor, two minor points. Um, uh, just make make sure you proofread and copy edit your slides. Uh, well, there were a lot of mistakes last time. This time there have been none that I've noticed, except for that one that's just disappeared. <laughs> okay. Um, uh, and please, and Autumn, Autumn Jeet, just you will notice on the video that you were swaying a bit. That's just part of nervousness. But just be aware of that when you watch the video. It says, oh my gosh, I had no idea. I was I was doing that. So two two minor points. Um, let's finish with uh, with uh, good points here. Um, you overcame the barriers to getting access to in information. Uh, Summit gave a very a good closure to the whole thing, reminding us. Who, who we were and, and, and what issue we had had addressed and, and welcomed our, our questions. I've got a few more here, but I um, don't want to steal your thunder. Any other good points that uh, you saw here? Very good, yeah. Well, uh, I haven't been here for the first day of your applied management class, but I have some students also on my other class, but I have to say I can see the improvements and also you have done your projects. I really appreciate one summit to facilitate the whole presentation. Well done and uh, go into your uh, great job of making this project happen. And uh, other team members, you also demonstrate your knowledge and uh, your confidence when you are doing the presentation. Uh, well done. Yeah. Thank you everyone for your time. So this is team five again. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you.